customers bring their problems to us and we are working in their problems, not our own problems. And our approach is that we are very strong on uh, software and system development for very complex systems. For instance, here we have a system where we show uh, haptical feedback. Haptical feedback is uh, something very complex on the control systems because what we try to do here is you have a sensing and try to make the doctors feel with this system here as it's actually touching the human body and trying to look for, for a tumor. And our approach is we're using very advanced control system algorithms, very advanced requirement engineering to, to solve this kind of problems. Our focus is the ergosm itself. So um, we have a system approach, uh, a system engineering approach, meaning we know how to uh, lock into requirements and put those requirements into a system design. So now we know how the system design these things. And then we're looking for partners who can give us the sensors, especially with our mother company, Robert Bosch, of course, they have a lot of sensors available. So we can use this, those sensors and then link it into a system. Our main focus is uh, electrical engineering, uh, control system design, uh, a lot of, of course, uh, um, computer science is a strong focus. And since our main vision is making machines intelligent, and therefore we spread our, our competencies we need. So we have physicians, we have uh, guys uh, that study mathematics, and you need, you need everybody on the team when, when it goes become it, when it comes to the complex systems. We try to develop the idea to a product from very early stages. So it's a teamwork with our customers. We work with our customer in a team and have uh, regular feedbacks. And of course, uh, probably in an agile project, you can. We try to build very early prototypes and test early, early, very early prototypes. Uh, so you can see, is this, is this going the direction uh, we want to go? We're working on embedded systems in the big machines for a long time, and we see uh, because with, with, with IoT, it's, it's about connecting machines, and there are not a lot of, not a lot of, not a lot of standards, not a lot of uh, common basis on how to connect things. So um, it's a lot about, about use case thinking. So it's about building up use cases with your customers. We have we have we have both hard parts. Of course, as an engineering company. We are, uh, we, are, we are strong in, uh, in developing algorithms, but since we have a system engineering approach, we can consult our customers how to design their products. And so we also have consulting and doing workshops how, how they find the solutions. To be honest, I, I, I don't believe or I don't have the pure, pure view of one big thing happening. So there's a lot of things happening at the same time. That, and probably this is only a personal point of view. Uh, there are going to be spaces where it's be uh, very, very bespoke, where it's very customer uh, specific. Other things are going to be developing, going to be developed into uh, standardization. Uh, and a lot of industries are coming together. It's very robotics coming in, algorithms, AI. So we'll see what's going to turn out, but uh, it's only personal point of view.